Great, we've got here in Guangdong Zhongshan Cuihen National Wetland Park. Let's see if we can find a kind of amazing fish. They can run, jump, and even climb trees. Can you guess what is it? Ha, it is the mud skipper. Oh, I know, we have it in Malaysia too. We call it the giant mud skipper. As it says, it has a stubby nose, canine teeth, and a big body. Let's check it out today. So the mud skipper inhabits at the shallow water area of the river mouse, bay, and the mangrove forest. Look, a mud skipper. Oh my god, look at its cheeks. It's so cute. But you know mud skippers compared to Malaysian ones? They're so much different. Look at this, the size. It's the size of my fingers. And also, the eyes, they're obviously more popped out. But don't most fish die when they're out of the water? Why don't the mud skippers? Well, the gills of mud skippers can contain a lot amount of oxygen inside. And also, the skins and mouth percussals can also have very good respiratory functions. And that's another way they breathe. That's allowed them to stay on the land for a longer time. And look at those well-developed pectoral fins. They move using these fins. And uh, yeah, it can provide, it's the same as the feet and provides good support. So how did the mud skippers come here? As you know, Guangdong area is rich with water resources. And that allowed the mud, mud skippers to move from one water to another. Despite their body is small, actually they can do a lot of things, such as increase the amount of oxygen in the soil, reduce the amount of heavy metal in the soil, which protect the soil quality. Ex except from doing that, the mud skippers can also effectively maintain the balance of the wetland ecosystem. So as a result, the mud skippers play important roles on protect the biodiversity in the Guangdong 